U.S. Special Forces killed ISIS leader Abu Bakr al-Baghdadi. They did a good job. Baghdadi got what he deserved. I want to remind Washington that the killing of Baghdadi is not only the success of the U.S. Many have contributed in the fight against the Islamic State. ISIS had been defeated, which paved the way for the U.S. military to remove Baghdadi. Let's hope that Washington will not sacrifice the interests of others contributing to the war on terror as it has done with the Kurds. The war on terror has won security for the U.S., but since 2001, Europe has become less secure and has been flooded with refugees. The Middle East fell into chaos and resulted in the deaths of countless people and waves of refugees. You can see that Europe and the Middle East have not benefited from the war on terror. With decreased spending in fighting the war on terror, and in recent years, the U.S. has resumed playing the Greek power game, which has brought new fundamental tensions to the world. Directly or indirectly, the war has helped the U.S. in the war on terror. But the U.S. has failed the war.